Welcome to another Yonsei ABC English podcast. My name is Dylan, and today we're going to talk about a very British English、uh, term or phrase called "It's not my cup of tea." Now that's quite a long phrase, and it's a little bit strange. But I'm sure you know British people are famous for drinking tea. So this expression, "It's not my cup of tea," that's not my cup of tea. This isn't my cup of tea. How can we use it? Well, we're not actually talking about tea. We're talking about our preference, things that we like or things that we prefer. So, truthfully, I'm not a big fan of classical music, but my girlfriend is. She likes classical music a lot, so she might play me some classical music. She likes it a lot. But I don't really like it, so I might say to her,、uh, "It's okay, but it's not my cup of tea. It's not my preference. It's not my style." So we use this expression, "It's not my cup of tea," when we want to show that、uh, we don't really like the thing that we're experiencing. It can be music, it can be food, it can be a sport or an activity. It can be anything where. You prefer a different style of something, or you have a preference for something different. So let me know about you. When could you use this phrase? It's not my cup of tea. Have you ever thought about it with your friends or your family, or when someone has offered you something and you wanted a way of saying, you know, that's not my style. I don't like it. So let me know about your situations. When could you have used? It's not my cup of tea. Thanks for stopping by, and I'll see you next time.